I hit the button by accident. No. Now I'm live early. All right, let me see if I can fix this. OMG. I'm not ready. <laughs> I hit the I hit the go live thing by accident. Hello. I'm not ready, so I got to go get my iPad. <laughs> I was like, "No!" I got the iPad. <laughs> OMG. Well, that's okay. I could just start early. Hey, Poppy. Hello, Miss Tizzy Lish. Did you get the birdcage okay? I know. What a huge box. That box cost me <laughs> more than the birdcage. <laughs> Hi, Debbie. Hey, Clemens. Um, I've been so busy. I haven't really, I've only had time to read a couple emails. So. My apologies. I've just been really busy. Aw, Poppy, you're a sweetheart. I know, I hit the button by accident. <laughs> I was trying to fix my tripod, and I had the my phone in there, and I hit the button. Hi, Karen, and I didn't want to do a new stream, so I just said the hell with it. Hello. Hey, Sandra. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Laura Jensen. Hey, Grammy. Yeah, I knew, I knew. I mean, it is beautiful. It really is. Hey, Lori. Hi, Annette. Hi, Mary Dugan. Jackie. How are my friends this weekend? Hi, Denise. You're new. Aren't they gorgeous, Jackie? I, <laughs> I know. I know. Yes. Uh, it's not too bad here today. I think it's in the 70s. It's not bad. I'm just trying to get myself situated here because I'm, I'm all off kilter today. This should be um, a fun sale. 103. OMG. Oh. Yeah, it's... Uh, Definitely been some crazy weather. Now, yesterday here, it was only in the 60s. Oh, awesome, Denise. Well, thanks for joining. Welcome to the Nut House. <laughs> I got to put my, hold on. Let me get my, um, my uh, iPad up and go in here. It's 83. Hello, Joanne Kuzmik. Oh, you know what? They probably got the air on like uh, 40 below zero. I hate when you go like um, into a restaurant and they have the air on, you know, 40 below zero and it's blowing right on you when you're trying to eat. Oh my God, I hate that. I hate that. All messages, skip ads. There we go. Oh my gosh, Jackie. Wow, well, I have quite a few fall and Halloween items today, so maybe that'll cool you off just a tad. <laughs> hey, sis. Yeah, it's um, Alexa, what's the temperature? Right now, it's 76 degrees Fahrenheit. Tonight, 
Expect a low of 61 degrees. It's 76 here today. And like I said yesterday, it was in the 60s. It was nippy yesterday. Yep, there you go, sis. And it's nice and breezy. The sun's out. Beautiful, perfect, perfect weather. Beautiful day. I was able to get outside and do some spray painting on a few things. <laughs> Clemens, I know. You poor thing. You poor thing. 72 where Laura is. Yep. But see, now, I always tell you guys, you will never hear me complain about the heat because the winters suck. And they last for nine months, you might as well say. So, yeah. Yes, indeedio. So I have Halloween, I have fall, I have some glassware, I have purses and stuff, I have um, um, oh yeah, that's bad, Lori. Yeah, that's bad. The poor wildlife has to have water. Gotcha. Where do you where do you normally um live, Clemens? No, don't tell me that, Mary. I don't want to hear that. No. Hey, Rose Flo. Oh my God, Joanne, we have so much fun in here. Let me tell you, we really do. We have a lot of fun. Feel free to hang out and chat. You know. Oh my God, really, Grandma? Not me. I'm over it. I am way over it. Hi, Cheryl Cornette. I got to grab some tea light candles and my lighter. Hi, Myrna. Hi, Elaine. Anywhere with four seasons. <laughs> I know that's right. Let me get my lighter and a couple of tea light candles. Ugh. Let me see here. All right. Okay. All right. I could switch them out. I could switch them out. All right. Okay, who did I miss? Robin, Nettie, hello, Cassandra, aloha. My girl Cassandra lives in beautiful Hawaii. How are things going there, um, Cassandra? I know it's been terrible there for y'all. Oh my gosh. Down south, you have two seasons, <laughs> spring and summer. <laughs> Oh, my God. He's a trip. He's actually in the living room right now, scratching on his scratch post. And then I have those little round things with the balls, and um, they go around and round, but they don't come out. Between him and Max playing with those things, it's hilarious. Well, Sophie likes it, too, but, yeah, they're so funny when they play with those. He was just doing that. Oh, dang it. I left my... Hold on, guys. I told you I wasn't ready. <laughs> oh, dear. I have a couple of um, craft items that I made today in the sale. I have my, my refill bottle, and then I have my already filled cup. Today's uh, flavor of the day is 
Watermelon. Hi, Virginia. Hi, Barb. I have been so busy that I haven't even had time to really check emails. But the emails that I did see, most of the items that people were wanting, I already had um, scheduled to be in the sale today. So I will tell you that much. So whatever wasn't in the sale today, and if you're still interested in it, let me know. <laughs> no, I didn't check. I really did not check um, emails. Like I said, I, I've been very busy, guys. Sorry about that. I was not ready for my sale today, so... Hey, how you doing, Kim? I wasn't ready for my sale today, so that's what I was working on this morning. And, of course, then I had stuff to do and take a shower and all that stuff. So, yeah, it's been kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. So, my apologies, peeps. I do try to get to my emails, you know. Oh, she's doing wonderful. She's doing wonderful, my little Winnie. She's so funny. She is really hysterical sometimes. <laughs> Hi, Terry Gardner. How are you? Well, no, because she doesn't go to daycare. I watch her. So, I mean, she has one little friend, um, but she doesn't see him very often. Yesterday, it sounded like she said ass. <laughs> I don't know what she's trying to say, but it came out as ass. <laughs> I forgot to tell her mom that yesterday. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what she's trying to say. I don't know if she's trying to say that or this or what it is, but it came out as ass. <laughs> so, mind you, I was laughing my ass off, but <laughs> I have no idea what's going through her little mind. <laughs> she is. She is. She is so funny. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. <laughs> My son cut the grass for me, and now I'm now I got the runny nose. Ugh. Ugh. I look like Rudolph. She didn't learn from you <laughs> or from me. <laughs> I can't read either. She didn't learn from me. No, she's that's she's not trying to say ass. She's trying to say something else, but but that's what it's coming out like. And I can't figure out what um what she's trying to say, but No, I don't swear in front of in front of her. Uh-uh. Thrifting is my happy place. This was a shirt I bought um, Alex at Chapter 2 Vintage. Um, her mom made these shirts, so I bought this quite a while, quite a while back. But it is. Thrifting is my happy place. Absolutely. Takes my mind off of everything. Um... So, I will, um, oh, how awesome. Yes, my granddaughter started walking right before her first birthday, which her and I share the same birthday. It was in July. Hi, Martha. 105, Martha. Oh, my God, you poor thing. You poor thing. I know all, I know all y'all are like, oh. I feel bad for you. I do. Because uh, now, is that is that with humidity too? Hi, Pat. Because we get very humid here. Like, extremely humid. 
I remember last year it was in the upper 90s, like 98, 97. And I was leaving the Goodwill. And as soon as I opened the door, my glasses fogged right up. Like that's how humid it was. Hey, Jan. Hi, Jules. Hola. Oh, no. Yes, I heard about that uh, storm. Oh, my gosh, Robin. I'm so sorry. Y'all are, like, melting over there. I know Texas is bad, too. And actually, over where Scott is, he was, like, he was really hot there, too, in Jersey. So, yeah. What are you going to do? I have some great stuff today, guys. So I think since I came on early by accident, I might as well start early. Hi, Patsy. Right, Martha? I know. Fuck. Yes. Yes, Lori. <laughs> yes. Of course, my my makeup will melt off when I get hot flashes, which is why I don't even bother wearing makeup anymore because it's just a hot mess. In Virginia. Hmm. Hi, Karen Harder. Yep, the gang is all here. Happy Saturday, Judy. Hi, Judy Joe. <laughs> How are you, sweetheart? Oh my gosh, I hope you're doing well. Yay. Hey, y'all, don't forget to hit the thumbs up for me, too. Um, my girl, Virginia, hello, with the blue wrench. Just put the link in the chat to uh, register for my live sales. So anybody who's new here, if you click that link and fill the form out, you will be all set to participate in my live sales. So you can go ahead and do that while we're chatting. Um, I will let you know that I am shipping from New York State. Uh, shipping is not included in um, the prices of the items. It is extra. And it's calculated by the size and the weight of the box and where you live. So, uh, I also have flat-priced items and offer-up items, which are pretty much like um, uh, like an auction. Hey, Gypsy, how are ya? Oh, perfect, Laura, you're good. All right, yay. Yes. I'm very happy to have new people. So, uh, yeah, I got lots of goodies here, guys. So why don't we just get started? We'll get started. How about that? Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Oh. All right. Oh, you yeah, you already registered, Cassandra. I got your information the other day, so you're good. Hey, Terry. How's it going? Virginia says you were born ready. All righty then. Well, let's get started. So usually I like to start out with smalls. Hi, Adelaide. How are you, sweetheart? Oh, okay, cool. That's okay. You can lurk away, Laura. No, Nobody has to purchase anything. If you just want to hang out, chat, have a good time, you go for it. All right, sis said, ready, Freddy, and Clement said, let's go. Okay, so we're going to start with smalls today. Hello, Miss Vicky. Good afternoon. My first item is this adorable little um, Home Co. bunny rabbit. Look at him. Oh, he is so stinking cute. I just love him. There's little fuzzies on him because I wiped them down with a, um, a sanitizing wipe. And they tend to leave little fuzzies. But look how cute he is. Um, there is his Home Co. sticker. 
And this little guy is free of chips. He's in awesome condition and he is $8, number 34. $8, number 34 for this little cutie patootie. Robin Cormay, you got it, Miss Robin. Thank you. <laughs> that. <laughs> All right, and that is going to Robin Cormay. All right. Thank you, Miss Robin. Okay, now I have um, these. I know he. <laughs> I, when I see little bunnies like that, I just can't resist them. I, I mean, they're looking at me on the shelf saying, like, take me home, you know? So, I do. Okay, I have um, this little pair of pottery. I don't know what to call them. I mean, you probably could put taper candles in here as well, but my thought was... Um, these would be really cute with a succulent in them. Um, they are signed. Looks like it says Elliot. Um, 05, 2005. Um, there were a couple of little chips in the paint. And I did touch those up so they wouldn't be so noticeable because it was on the blue and it looked kind of crappy. Um... But for the pair of these, it's $10, number 29. $10, number 29. Hey, Karen Williams. How's it going? And I see Miss Patsy for those. Thanks, Patsy. Okay. Okay, uh, let's do this. All right, here's some Halloween for you guys. I have this awesome Halloween candle. It is battery operated and it is um, like wax. This plastic um, outer covering does come off if you wanna take it off uh, so that it's not shiny. I'll show you what it, well, I can show you what it looks like without this on there. Maybe, maybe not. I'm just gonna leave it alone. <laughs> um, but this is fantastic, I love it. It is uh, almost four and a half inches tall and three inches in diameter. I know, isn't it awesome? It's great. So this candle is $10 and it's number 37. $10, number 37. Okay, I will, Karen. Barb, you got it, love. You got it. Whoops. Let me fix that because it's coming off. There we go. All right, Barb gets the Halloween candle. Okay, um, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to get all these smalls out of my way here off the table. Okay, next up. Oh, did you, Barb? Was that in one of your emails? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> hey, Pamela Bug, how you doing, love? <laughs> okay, I have this pair of vintage um, angel. I almost said anal. <laughs> Oh my God. Wow. What the hell is wrong with me today? Holy shiznit. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, 
Hey! <laughs> yes, Karen! <laughs> um, <laughs> Angel is what I was trying to say. These beautiful little vintage angel ornaments. <laughs> hey, let me lemon. <laughs> um, they're in perfect condition. No cracks or chips. I know, right, Poppy? That's all I would need. Um, they're in. They're in excellent condition. These are twelve dollars for the pair. Number 26. Winnie has an excuse, what's yours? <laughs> I know. <laughs> You're right, Jackie. I don't have an excuse. I just have issues. <laughs> Hi, Tarnished Treasures. How are you, hon? <laughs> $12 for the pair. Number 26. <laughs> oh, dear. I don't know why she said that. I really do not. Call me. I hate that song, sis. Oh, my God. I hate that song. Okay. No takers on the little angels. I have. This is very cool. Now, this is going to be an offer up, and it's going to start at $12. Hi, Wendy Melton. Yes, Tammy, you are. You are here. <laughs> I had a 26. Oh, Midge. Hi, Midge. Okay, you got them. Was it Midge that had it first? Okay, I got it. Okay, thanks, Midge. Gotcha. There, is there a lag today, guys? Okay. So, as I said, this is going to start at, uh, I said $12, correct? I believe. Okay. Okay. It is this vintage, hi, Janet Green. There's a bad lag, okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, no lag for you, Pamela, okay. Um, this is, I guess, a vintage um, thimble holder. Look how cool this is. There's all these vintage thimbles in here. It's got, it's in this little footed container and there's a sticker on the bottom. Hi, Susan. Hold on, my, trying to get my, um, it says gold tone product. It's really faded. So I can't even really make it out. It just says gold tone product on that little label there. But it does have all these little, um, look at this thimble. This one, it looks like brass. And then there's this one. And this one has a, um, like a diamond design going around it. And then there are two... There's one like this with a little pattern going around. Those look like, um, are those stars or diamonds? I can't tell. They look like stars. They look kind of like little stars. And then this one is just, um, has the plain band. So there's four symbols in the box or in the container and then there's this little thimble on top and it's got all these cute little uh, rhinestone flowers on the top 
And I just think this is so stinking cute. This was sent to me by my friend Arlene. I have never seen anything like this. I think it's so cool. And it is, let's see, two and a half inches in diameter. And it's an inch and a half, an inch and a quarter tall. I know, isn't it neat? How cool is that? All right, I'm going to type in my sold and we are going to count this down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. It is so cute. Okay, let me just refresh really quick, guys. If it'll let me. Come on now, what the heck? All messages. Okay, it is going to go to Susan Lynn for $23. Congratulations, Susan. And thank you, everybody that offered on that. Number 40 to Susan Lynn. For 23. All right. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Okay. Um, my next item is this really neat, where is this tape from? I don't know why that tape is on there. But anyways, um, it's this beautiful, it's a 70 inch round fall tablecloth. And it's this beautiful, it's like a, um, oh, what do you call that? Muslin, maybe, material? With all these beautiful fall leaves on it. This is what it looks like on the table. Hey, Robert, how's it going? It's very pretty, 100% cotton. Easy Care, 70 inch round, and it is $14, number eight. $14, number eight, new in package. And I see Jan for that. Thank you, Jan. You got it. Jan, Jan, Jan. All right. Okay. Let me get that out of my way. All right. You are very welcome. Thank you. Um, I'm going to do this little guy. I think this is so cool. Um, look at this. This is a clown... I guess a wine stopper, it, it has a, an attached cork. He is playing what, a trumpet or a trombone? Looks like a trombone. And then it has this. So I don't know, you know, I don't know, does this go around the top of the bottle, perhaps? Hi, Jennifer McDonald, hi, Joan. It's just really cool, and it's um, like a metal with enamel. Very cool. And it is $10, number 25. $10, number 25. Well, it could be a saxophone. It could be a sax. No, I don't think it's a saxophone. Okay, so this does go over the bottle. Okay, so I had it correct. It's it's kind of heavy, so I'm thinking that this is like, you know, it's 
solid, it's solid metal of some kind, but it's very cool. Oh, yay, Sin! <laughs> All right. Okay, no takers for that. That is okay. Um, maybe, it, I mean, maybe, it is heavy, I want to say. I don't see any markings on it saying what it is, um, but it's just really awesome. I, it's a very cool piece. Not on a wine box, no. <laughs> but you know, you could stick a straw in that hole where the wine comes out on the wine box and save watching a glass. Heck yeah. <laughs> How about that? That'll work. <laughs> I'm in rare form today, peeps. Just letting y'all know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Great idea, right? <laughs> okay. Um, hi, Maria California Thrifter. How are you? All right. I have this very cool wallet. Look at this wallet. Talk about colorful. How cool is this? This thing is brand new. It still has the, the store hanger thing on it. And um, yes, another tip from my kitchen. It's brand new, never used. It still has the silica packets in it and everything. No, it's not leather. It's like that coated canvas. It's beautiful. A beautiful, um, what's the name brand? It says GD on it. I don't know, but um, yeah, it's gorgeous. And anyways, this is uh, $12 and it's number 24. $12, number 24. Did I show y'all? Oh, I did show you the inside. It's got all those little pockets. $12, number 24. Looks like a Gucci. Yeah, I don't know. It just says GD on it, so I have no idea. I don't see anything on any of the pull, um, the zipper pulls or anything. Um, I see Clemens for this one. Thank you so much. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to do this so I could get it out of my way. Now, this, I have the original box for this item. And um, it is going to be an offer up. And it's going to start at $14. Hey, Suzuko. You're welcome, Clemens. Thank you. And it is for this fiber optic scarecrow. <laughs> I know you guys can't see it because all the lights are on. But there's all kinds of fiber optics going on here in his little hat. He is the cutest thing ever. OMG. Look at he lights up. He's all lit up on the inside. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. You know what? Let me shut off the lights because you guys are not getting the full effect. Hold on. I need to get one of them dang clapper things. I don't know if it's going to help with this window right over here, but we'll give it a shot. We will give it a shot. Let's see. Yeah, you can see it better now. 
Isn't this adorable? Oh my God, I love him. I just got the cord wrapped around his, um, his legs there, but oh, he is so cute. <laughs> I love him. I love him. Isn't it adorable, Maria? I love scarecrows too. Oh my gosh. He's too cute. All right. So I see Jeffrey is at $20. I'm going to type in my sold. All right. Ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. Oh, you have a bigger one? Oh, okay. Yeah, this one is, um, if I go to the top of his hat, Twenty, twenty, and twenty and a half inches. He goes, but if I just go like to here, he's like fourteen inches. But yeah, he is so cute. So Jeffrey Ross, that is yours for um, twenty dollars. So thank you. Let me unplug it. And get him over here on my cart. <laughs> he is adorable. I love him. He's got little pumpkins on his pants. Look at look at all the little pumpkins on his pants. <laughs> How stinking cute. And while I have the lights out, I'm gonna show this other, this next item too. Uh, let me find it. Where is the, uh, that was number 23. So $20 to Jeffrey Ross. Thanks, Jeffrey. Okay. This item is also an offer up and it's going to start at $14. Hold on. Let me. Put that in the chat. Yes, don't forget the thumbs up, guys. I have this light up ghost. Avon also makes a light up ghost like this, but this one is not Avon. This was sold at the Bonton, and um, it plugs in and has a toggle switch. The Avon one was on a base and it took batteries or you could plug, you know, plug it in that way. So that was the difference between um, this one and the Avon one did not have um, the ghost holding a, a pumpkin either. So he is adorable. Love him. And then you can just switch them on and off with the, um, with the uh, toggle switch. So that's what he looks like unlit. This is just some, um, I don't know what that is on there. I have to clean it. Hi, Carmen. Isn't it beautiful? Hi, Joan. Yeah, so he's pretty cool. I love him. And you know how I am with my ghosts. Um, let me tell you how tall he is. I forgot. 10 inches tall. And the bottom part is 6 inches wide. 6 inches this way, long ways. All right, let me type in my sold here. All right, guys. 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, one, and sold. 
All right, he is so cute. I have the Avon one. Just gonna unplug it and, all right. I'm gonna refresh and see who, who got that one. All comments. Gypsy Moon for $30. Congratulations, Gypsy. You got it. He's so cute. Yay. I do not have the original box for this guy, though, but that's all right. All right. And that was number 22. $30 to Gypsy. All right. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Hi, Cece. I got to turn my lights back on. Hold on. Ugh. There's one and two. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's do a couple Christmas things. How about that? Myrna, let's see. I'm just trying to see if I missed anybody. Okay, um, let's do this guy. Um, this is an adorable little Santa mug. Now, he did have um, chips that I did touch up, um, and you'll be able to see them back here. See that? I missed that one. Um, but this it would be really cute. Did, what did I say? What did I say? I didn't say snowman. Well, anyway, it is a snowman. <laughs> um, this would be really cute. Oh, dang. I'm sorry. It's a snowman. Um, for an assemblage. If you wanted to do an assemblage in this would be awesome. Love the black and white with the red. He is so stinking cute. Look at him. OMG. This little guy is made, it's made by Holly Hill. And he is $8, number 14. $8, number 14. Yeah, that's right, Judy. <laughs> I see Barb Connolly for that little cutie. <laughs> Works for me. Works for me. No, I do not, Jan. <laughs> All right, Barb Connolly. Thank you, Barb. Yes, it was the same holiday. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. These are out of my collection. And they are so stinking cute. These are going to be an offer up. And they are going to start at... Uh, $12. Look at these adorable little native salt and pepper shakers. We have the boy and the girl. Hey, fly girl. How's it going? Uh, not really. I have a couple, um, Judy, but for the most part, I've had to... I've had to downsize my, my my Christmas decor. Look at how cute these are. No chips or cracks. Aren't they adorable? Now this one is missing its little stopper. I'm telling you, they are absolutely adorable. 
I'm doing good. How are you? It's a gorgeous day here in uh, upstate New York. <laughs> Absolutely adorable. I do not have a stopper to, to replace this one with, I don't think. If I do, it'll be a cork one, and I will replace it. I know I don't have any plastic ones. But this one, they should have had cork stoppers anyways, I think. But, you know, that's just me thinking, and it could be dangerous. So, you know, just saying. But anyways. <laughs> All right. I am going to start to count these down. Let me just type in my... Um, my stop or my sold duh it's gorgeous day in california too awesome my aunt and uncle live in california okay <clears throat> 10 9 8 7 <laughs> poor pamela bug <laughs> 6 5 4 3 2 1 and sold <laughs> Pamela's melting away down there in Alabama. Tuscaloosa. Uh, Sierra Madre. Sierra Madre. And Terry Trahan is going to take those for $21. Congratulations, Terry. And thank you. Thank you very much. Uh. Hey, Dana Grace. Okay. Thanks, Terry. Oh, okay. They actually are here. They come here. They have a house here. And they come here from May until uh, mid-October because it's so hot there in the summertime. So they come here for like five, six months. All right, guys. Um, let's go and do, let's do this item. This is pretty cool. This was given to me by my friend Frog Larry. And it's going to be an offer up. Um, we're going to start it at, yeah, yeah, they, they enjoy coming here. And um, it's my mom's brother. It's her youngest brother. So he gets to spend time with her too. So um, this is going to start at $12. All right. And it is this very cool Lucite globe. How cool is this? Yes, I still talk to Frog Larry. He um he's not he's not on YouTube a lot, you know, he just pops on every now and again. So um, but he's doing well. He's doing well. Um, he's not happy with the thrifting situation in San Francisco. Many of, of his thrifting places closed after COVID. So, yeah, it is pretty cool. I will tell you. Hi, Eugenia. Uh, this is four, no, three and three quarter inches tall. I'm going to show you the, the, um, the countries on here up close. It's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. This is like a uh, lucite, you know, like the grapes are made out of. Yeah, it's pretty cool, and it does spin, and it's on a gold tone um, base. It's very, very cool, um, and I already measured it for you. 
All right, I'm gonna type in my sold and count it down. All right, guys, 10, nine, eight, seven, six. No, I didn't. No glow. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, and sold. No glow, y'all. No glow. All right. Yes, that's my wind chimes. I have two sets of them on my front porch. Jojo, the thrifty teacher. Hi, Jojo. Welcome to the to the nut house. Yay. Myrna is going to take that globe for $28. Congratulations. And thank you, everybody, that offered on that. $28 to Myrna. Congratulations, Miss Myrna. Yay. Okay, uh, let's do a flat priced item. Okay. Um, I have this beautiful set of three hand painted plates. And these are in the shape of a scallop shell. Look at these. And they are all signed. Um, here is the signature on this one. So uh, they are graduated sizes. This is the largest. Then we have this one. Aren't they beautiful? I absolutely love these. And then this is the smallest one with the little forget-me-not flowers. And I believe they're all painted by the same person. Uh, G. Daly. G. Daly. So it's for all three. And the price is $18, number 12. $18. Number 12 for the set of three. Robin, okay, you got those. Thank you. Uh, number 12, Robin. All right. Um, for my cat lovers out there, I have a couple, uh, cat items today. Um, they're flat priced items as well. So we have this guy. He is a gray tabby cat. And he's got his little necklace on and his little, um, bird on a spring. He's just a little shelf sitter, and you can see he's a he's a nice size. He is ten and a half inches tall. He's just so cute. I absolutely love him. Made out of wood. He is sixteen dollars, number forty two. Sixteen dollars. Number 42. Okay, I see Myrna. Myrna got that one. Thank you, Myrna. All right. Let's do a couple purses. Well, you know what? Let me do these first so I could get them off the purses. He has a little mouse on his, oh yes he does, yes he does. Yeah, right there. I forgot about that little guy down there. <laughs> yep. All right. Now, I have not washed this yet and it does have a small um, stain. 
But let me show you this, guys. This is a flat priced item. Look at this beautiful, um, I'm going to call it a table cover because you could put this on your table on top of a red or green tablecloth. Um, I, I didn't measure it, but I can. It has a small stain right there where the, um, where the uh, flame is. You see that? Hello, Nikki King from Australia. Wow. Welcome. Um, so let's see. How long is this? Let me do it this way. I know it's just a square. Well, no, it's smaller than a card table, but it is um, square. It's, it's, it would not fit on an entire card table. So it's 32 inches square. Hey, Zeus. 32 inches square. And it's, it's just fabulous. And it is sixteen dollars, number forty-three. Sixteen dollars, number forty-three. Yes, welcome, Nikki. We have we have a lot of fun here on this channel. Thanks for stopping in. Sixteen dollars, number forty-three. Whoops. Rose, okay, you got it. Thank you. Rose. Okay. Hi, Arlene. I just sold one of the, the cats, the wooden cats. Okay, now I have, this is a beautiful set for fall. Okay, so what we have here is this beautiful runner with this gorgeous fall, very rustic pattern. So this is the table runner. And then it repeats back to the deer. And it has these pretty tassels on the end. Um, so this is what it looks like. And it has matching napkins as well. Um, this runner is, hang on guys, let me fold it in half and then I can measure it. Oh, for crying out loud. For crying out loud. Just try to make sure it's right in half. Okay, so I believe it's like, uh, I'm going to say it's close to 60 inches long. Uh, it's 28 and a half times two. So let's just say 60 inches. Oh no, hang on. I'm, I'm measuring from the wrong spot. It is 68 inches long and 13 and a half inches wide. 68 by 13 and a half. And then it has... These are all starched and beautiful. Like, I don't think these were ever used. So you're going to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten napkins. And the runner for, oh, and look how cool. There's little buttons on here on the back um, 
for $16, number 27. $16, number 27. It's a beautiful set. The colors are amazing. Oh, Arlene. Yum. Carol Verbeerst is going to take that. Thanks, Carol. Oh, my gosh. I love liver and onions. Ah, uh, thank you, CC. <laughs> yes, I, 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 oh my God, yes. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, now, I'm going to do a couple purses. I have, this is a beautiful, um, for fall, this beautiful um, Nicole Miller, gorgeous red purse. It's got the two zippers here. And you can put things in here, y'all. Yes. It's got another zipper pocket on that side. This is in fantastic condition. It's got... All kinds of pockets and zipper pockets. This this is in this is really in like new condition. Okay. Normally that's the only time I will buy a purse is if it's in like new condition. Um, this is gorgeous. And this is $18 number three. $18, number three. Love the shade of red. And all the zippers work fine. They're fine. Myrna, okay. I got you for that, Miss Myrna. Thank you. Don't worry, I got more purses, Eugenia. <laughs> Uh, $18, Myrna. All right. Let's do this. This is really, I love this. I actually bought this for myself and I never used it. Look at this adorable Winnie the Pooh tote bag. Oh my goodness. How stinking cute is this? And it's like a, um, it's like a, um, it's like a rubbery vinyl. It's so stinking cute. I'll show you the inside. It's got a, um, a Velcro little, uh, closure, but it's got like pockets on the inside and stuff. There's a zipper pocket there. This is wonderful. Oh my gosh. How cute. Hey, Everyday Crafter. It's got little pockets on each end. Just adorable. Um, like new condition. It is $22, number 44. $22, number 44. It's got all the little bees. <laughs> so stinking cute. Oh, absolutely, Lori. Hi, Lori. Yeah, this is great. Oh, and it's got, it's got this. Um, you can make it, you can cinch it, I guess, or something. I don't know. I don't know what that's for. But whatever. <laughs> I don't know. But it is so stinking cute. I just love it.
Oh, cool. Hey, Christy. Did I see Nate or am I cracking up? Hi, Nate. How are you? Okay, no takers on the Winnie the Pooh bag. All right. Christmas. I have these adorable snowman head, ah, salt and pepper shakers. These are absolutely adorable. No cracks, chips, or flea bites. Look at those little faces. They are so stinking cute. These are going to be incomers plus lagging. I know, right? Um, $10, number 50. $10, number 50. <laughs> Sis, okay, you got them. You got them, girl. All right. Thanks, sis. Whoops. All right. Now, this next item has to be the coolest thing that I have seen in a long time. Hi, Bev. How are you? This was sent to me by Arlene, and I pulled it out today because I wasn't quite sure what it was when I first got it. And then I'm like, oh, my God, this is awesome. This is an offer up. Hold on. It is going to start at $18. All right, check this out. Now, first, let me show you. This is made by Hostess Wear, J&M Heller Company. This turns around and you put your birthday cake on here. Yeah, it don't sound creepy or nothing. <laughs> that would haunt my dreams. No, <laughs> it's because I got to really wind it. Hold on. I'm trying to, here, let's put this on here. Everybody's saying, hi, Tyler. Hello. Jeffrey Ross is laughing. Me neither. It just seems like something that they would pull out of the conjuring, you know? <laughs> <laughs> they would put it out in the Rain Warren's, like, museum. <laughs> I just think this is the coolest thing ever. Can you imagine walking out with somebody's birthday cake on here? How cool would that be? It is pretty cool. Hey, Beth, how you doing? Jeffrey Ross said, I agree, Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> Jeffrey, you're not supposed to agree with my son. I've seen too many movies, so is Jeffrey. <laughs> <laughs> I know, isn't that awesome, Dana Grace? OMG. I wish I had a cake to put on here right now. <laughs> Same. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> and you can turn it off. It's got the switch to turn it on and off. So I see Tizzy Lish at $18. I'm going to count this down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 
and sold. What'd you say, Tammy? Oh, you have one of them for your grandkids? I never saw anything like this. Did it come with a soul? <laughs> You're a jerk. <laughs> Did it come with a soul? Oh my God. All right, so this is going to Eugenia Butron. Congratulations, Eugenia, and thank you so much. It's very cool. Very cool. All right, Miss Eugenia. Oh, uh, I forgot what number was that. Hang on one second. I got to look at it again. Number 38. Okay, Eugenia. I had an aunt named Eugenia, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, shoot, I put it on the wrong spot. Congratulations. He takes after me. <laughs> Susan. <laughs> Are you really, Eugenia? Congratulations. Is it a boy or a girl? How awesome. She's having a baby. The one that just bought the um the cake spinner. Congrats. That's I'm having a pickle. <laughs> Awesome, yay! All right. So this next um, item is a choice lot. And um, these are $14. It's a boy. I have three-year-old twin girls. Oh my gosh, God bless you. How awesome, that's great. Yay! All right, um, choice lot. These are $14 each. These are Fenton, Daisy, and Button top hats. I have one in clear and one in milk glass. No cracks, chips, or flea bites on either one of these. Let me just double check. Wait a minute. Is that the mold line? Yeah, the mold lines are very rough. Okay, so yeah, maybe a little flea bite on this one right here. Tiny little flea bite, but this one is perfect. So $14 each, number two, number two. These are both the large ones. <laughs> Karen, that's all right. <laughs> hey, hey, what's going on, Marianne? Um, Marianne and I will be having a sale at the end of this month. Um, all in the attic treasures, just so you know. All right, no takers on those, and that is quite all right. I will put those aside. <laughs> CC. <laughs> uh, I don't know. What do you got in the air fryer? <laughs> Mini tacos, dude. Mini tacos. And he's like, having a bowl of cereal, too. And I had two pickles. And two pickles. That's quite a combo, you know? Um, Kay, which one would you like? You want the milk glass one or the clear glass? I know, right, Virginia? <laughs> I'm not until you try it. No, thanks. I'm good. It's all about balance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kim. <laughs> See, Kim knows what I'm saying. Kim. <laughs> 
I know, who was the one pregnant exactly, Clemens? <laughs> yes, Susan, yes. <laughs> K. Oh, you want both. Okay, you got it, girl. You got it. Okay, my love, let me put those down there. Thank you so much, Kay. Okay. All right. I have an upcycle for you guys today. This is the... This, I think, came out really neat. Savory and sweet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kim, you're a trip. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, this is going to be a flat-priced item unless y'all want me to do it as an offer-up. Um, let me show you this. So, this was just a plain wooden box, and I, I did this with it. I put these gorgeous, um, the lily pad flowers on here. What are, the, are those considered lotus flowers? I only put a flower here and on the top. So this is the item and I will measure it. It is seven and a quarter inches long and three and a half inches tall. Thank you, Susan. And five inches wide. Whoops. Um, so this is going to be $16 and it's number six. $16, number six. I think it's great for anything. You could put anything in here, jewelry, I mean, anything. $16, number six. And Jeffrey Ross is going to take that. Thank you, Jeffrey. I'll have to sign, I'll have to sign the bottom. Hi, Ann. Yes, when I remember, I do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks, Marianne. Thanks, Maria. All right. Um, next up, I have... Now I have to make another one. I can try. I can try. I find those wooden boxes all the time. I have these vintage salt and pepper shakers. These are very cool. Um... These were sent to me by Arlene as well. So they have this pretty etched leaf pattern. Oh, Eugenia. Um, let me have, uh, what you call it? Uh, Virginia. Virginia, would you put my link in the chat for my uh, live sale registration? So... This is the, these are the, there it is. Thank you, Virginia. Just click that link, Eugenia, and fill the form out, and then you're all set. <laughs> Tammy. Uh, these are gorgeous. There's all your little holes in the top. <laughs> these are really neat. Oh, they're sterling. These are sterling, y'all, is what Arlene is telling me. Um, weighted. Here, let me show you. They are sterling. Absolutely. So, for these, it is going to be $16, number nine. $16, Number nine for the sterling silver and glass salt and pepper shakers. 
And I see Jan for those. Okay, gotcha, Jan. All right, thank you. Okay, next up I have this lot of three fall pumpkins made out of different fabrics. These are so stinking cute. Hell yeah. Love the fall stuff. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Way better than Christmas. And then this one. So you'll get all three of these. <laughs> Susical said Tyler buy them. <laughs> hey Sally. <laughs> nah, because I'm a haggle. <laughs> I'm a haggle. Yeah, he's a haggler. So for the set of three of these awesome pumpkins, I know, aren't these great? The, oh, she's talking about the salt and pepper shakers. Oh. For the set of three of these, it's fifteen dollars, number thirty-six. Either way, though. Fifteen dollars, number thirty-six. Very good comedic timing. Hi, Deanna. I gotcha. He said he didn't take my bucket, Kim. I don't know where it went. What? <laughs> Uh, number 36 is going to Deanna. I like vaguely remember you asking me about a bucket and me just going, what the hell am I going to do with a bucket? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> All right. Let me put that over there. Got it. Thank you, Deanna. Okay. Uh, okay. Hi, Desi. How are ya? Oh my gosh, I haven't seen you in forever. Awesome. All right. So this next item is awesome, but it does have a little bit of damage, which I will show you. I just put a tea light in here so it's not really lit up yet. Hello, Barb Ponder. Welcome. Another new person. Thanks for stopping in. So this is a pumpkin candle holder. You could use a tea light or a little votive candle. I love his face. He is so cute. But he does have a crack right there. That's all right. Unfortunately, there is a crack right here, and it does go all the way through. Um, but it should be fine, like, in shipping. I could put a line of crazy glue on that from the inside, and it should be perfectly fine. It's so stinking cute. I know, we all have a crack or two. So for that person that's been leaving nasty messages on my um, in my comments about selling chipped or cracked items. Take it from my peeps in here. We all have chips and cracks, and they're aware of the chips and cracks, and if they choose to purchase the item, it's their business and not yours, if you're watching. So anyway... This adorable little pumpkin, and it's a nice size. It is a nice size. Um, it is $12, number 18. $12, number 18. Isn't she rude, Rosie? Hi, Rosie. <laughs> yes. It's, you know what? It is none of her business what I'm doing, so... Whatever. 
Haters are your biggest fans in the skies, yo. Oh, yeah? Okay, well. You know why? Because they watch everything you do. Apparently. That's right, Tammy. Me with my box cutter. Mm. Yes. Mm. All right, Jeffrey. You're going to get the pumpkin for $12. Thanks, Jeffrey. Hell yeah, Jeffrey. Good purchase, bud. <laughs> well, he just went downstairs to eat, so... <laughs> Yo, a ridiculous amount of mini tacos, too. Let me, let me. Oh, my God. Give me one. Thanks. Aha, there's like 32 of them. Oh, my God. I'm going to eat all of them. Right, Dana? I mean, seriously. Thank you. <laughs> I just got done working out. I'm starving. Apparently. All right. So, we got that one. No, Arlene, I still haven't sent it to him. I'm going to hold out on it till he sends me my package, which I've been waiting for for about a year now. <laughs> exactly, Ann. Exactly. Mm. <laughs> That's right, Arlene. He's supposed to send me a cord for my um, 1930s coffee pot that I've been wanting to sell for the last seven months now. So, you know. <laughs> Anyways, oh, these are good. <laughs> Ooh, a hot one. I'm sure I will, Sally. Oh, do you, Dana? <laughs> you better tell Scott then. Tell him to send me the damn cord. Okay, they're called Jose Olay Mini Tacos. Jose Olay Mini Tacos. All right, guys, let's keep moving. I have this very awesome... Oil slick. <laughs> Oil slick candle holder. Now this is for the, um, oh my God, here we go. Where's the crickets? The taper, not taper candles. The, um, oh my gosh. The other candles, the fat round ones. Pillar, thank you, Maria. Pillar candles, ding, ding, ding. Pillar candle. I think this is so cool. Look at this. Oh my gosh. That It looks gold or whatever on the back. Um, This is $16 and it's number 13. $16, number 13. It is very cool. I love this. I have something like this that I made into my bird bath outside. It was a bowl with this really cool um, paint job. Very cool. All right. Oh, I see Clemens for that one. Thank you. All right, let me put that down here. All right, um, Halloween, some more Halloween. 
These are awesome. Oh my God. Okay. Now, these are, it's a choice lot. They are $16 each. These were somebody's ceramic um, project. And they are initialed on the bottom. Their initials are PW. So we've got this ghost here <laughs> with the bat hanging out with him. He is so cute. Okay, and then we have this guy. And he's got a ghost on his head and a little pumpkin. Um, I don't, number six was already sold. Number six was the, um... What are you guys doing? Number six was already sold. Binks, you got to get off my paper, dude. No, I haven't given the number yet. It's a choice lot. They're, they're each $16, and I haven't even given the number yet. I'm trying to show the two items. <laughs> like, what are you guys doing? This is the second ghost. <laughs> so you will get your choice of the two of these. <laughs> Okay, the first person to put the number in has first pick. <laughs> I know everybody, <laughs> everybody's excited. Okay, so $16 each number, wait for it, wait for it, number one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the first person I saw was Myrna. So Myrna, which one would you like, dear? Do you want the ghost that's covering his eyes or this guy here with the chick? You want both. Okay, you got them. You got them. <laughs> that was hilarious. You guys were just too excited. <laughs> Bubbies, you got to get off my paper. I got to write down. Myrna gets both of those. All right. Congrats, Myrna. <laughs> okay. Next up, I have two beautiful uh, floral plates. One of them is a saucer that's missing its cup, but it was so pretty, I got it anyway because it could still be a beautiful display plate. And it is um, this one here. Look how pretty that is. This is Lefton. And I just think it's so beautiful. Oh, Binksy will never be for sale. That's my boy. That's my boy. Huh, Bubbies? Hi, Bubbies. What are you doing? <laughs> Hi, baby. What are you doing? <laughs> um... This is just gorgeous. And like I said, it is left in. I'll show you the mark on the bottom. 
and I believe it's six inches. Let me see here. Maybe not. Uh, five and three quarters. And it is eight dollars, number 41. Eight dollars, number 41. Yeah, he, <laughs> he, you know, believe it or not, none of these cats like people food. Okay. Then the next plate I have, this is gorgeous, and it is um, hand painted and signed. And it is seven and a half inches in diameter. And it is this beautiful rose plate. <laughs> Jackie, there is the signature. Wait, where is the signature? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. There's the signature. This is stunning. Absolutely stunning. This is $16, number 11. $16, number 11. Martha, you got it. All right. Number 11 goes to Martha. Thank you, Martha. Okay, listen, go and do that someplace else, dude. Okay. All right. Uh, let me see. Okay, I have another cat. Speaking of cats, this one is a wooden cat shelf sitter in gray and white. And you know, he just sits on, uh, number 37 is something that was already sold. It was the Halloween candle that I sold in the very beginning of the sale. This is so cute, and he just sits on your, on your shelf like that. He is adorable. Um, this little guy is fourteen dollars, number thirty three. Fourteen dollars, number thirty three, and I do have to clean him up just a little bit. I think he's adorable, and Sis is going to take that one too. All right, you got it. Bring this over here so I have room on the cart. Sis! All right. Sandra. Okay, guys. Um, let me see. Okay. I have this beautiful set of, it's a set of three. Hey, poodle. How's it going, girl? This beautiful set of three cobalt blue uh, cordial glasses. All three are in perfect condition. No flea bites, nothing. They're gorgeous. And they are three and three quarter inches tall. And you will get all three of these beautiful cordial glasses for $12, number 35. $12, number 35. Oh, they're so pretty. So pretty. Uh-oh, Clemens wants those. Okay, thank you. Set these over here. All right. 
Next up is this beautiful, this is going to be an offer up. And uh, we're going to start this at um, $14. And it is for this beautiful Fenton Amber Hobnail Swung Vase. Uh, it's in perfect condition. There's no chips, cracks, or flea bites. Um, the mold lines are a little bit rough on it. But other than that, it's perfect. And it is 10 inches tall. 10 inches tall. And it's, it's a gorgeous color, guys. Look at that color. Hi, Lise. I know Rosie loves Fenton. I love Fenton. I That's my favorite glass company is Fenton. But I also love like uh, Fostoria, Cambridge, Heisey. Yes. Oh, Northwood. Northwood is my second favorite. Absolutely a beautiful, beautiful piece. With fall coming up, this is, this is, oh, do you, Lori? Oh, okay. Yes, it is. I, I just love amber glass for fall. Yes, Northwood is, is beautiful. They have some amazing pieces. Um, all right, I'm going to start to count this down. Let me just type in my sold. All righty, 10, 9, 8, Seven, it's a offer up poodle. It was an offer up and the highest offer is $19. Oh, now it's 25. Um, okay, let me start over. 10, <laughs> 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. All right, I'm going to put that over here. Okay, thanks, Angela. Yes, as Angela mentioned, um, that is going to go to Joan Griswell. Thank you so much, Joan. Uh, that is number 17 for 25. Um, I have... Two new Halloween t-shirt designs that are available um, in my merch store. So I just wanted to let you all know that. Also, um, I don't know how many of you out there um, have to use uh, like ice packs or whatever for pain. But I do have um, one of those um, ice machines that I got when I had my shoulder surgery. Um, you put the the water in the ice in it, and you and it's continuous cold. Um, if anyone is interested in that, please send me an email. Um, um, I'll show it to you. Because I don't need it anymore, and um, it's just taking up space. So this is um, the machine that I'm talking about. It's called... Iceman. And these are like $200 machines. So, um, you know, I just wanted to put it out there because um, I, like I said, I have, Virginia, you want it? Okay, well, I'll send you an email, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll send you an email. All right, let me put this down here. 
I've, I've, I've been meaning to ask y'all about it. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. Um, this is the... This is how it goes. Okay, so you could use it. Uh, I had it for my shoulder. <laughs> Does it glow? It's got everything is here. You put your, your ice and water inside here. And <laughs> does it have any flea bites? You guys are killing me. <laughs> I'm trying to help people out. <laughs> Because I can't use this anymore. So, and hopefully I don't have to have any more surgeries for crying out loud. But anyways, that's it. Okay, so. No cracks or chips. <laughs> Works perfectly fine. <laughs> um. I know, probably, but I'm not worrying about it. I, I don't have room for the for this stuff, you know what I mean? Okay, so anyways. <laughs> All right. Next up, I have this um, awesome. This is a vintage set of glass coasters. Yes, that's what that's what I had it for, Jackie, when I had the rotator cuff surgery. <laughs> Karen. <laughs> These come with their original metal caddy. The caddy is like a, a gold tone color. <laughs> there are six coasters in here. For this awesome vintage set, it's $18, number 47. $18, number 47. For the set of six coasters in the carrier. Decoupage the outside. <laughs> Are you guys picking on me or what? <laughs> All right, I see CC for those. I see CC for those. <laughs> oh, guys. <laughs> no, not you guys. No. Why would you want to do that? I just saw Wortley. Wait a minute. When did Wortley get in here? Hold on a minute. I could have sworn I just saw Lori Wortley. I'm cracking up. I'm losing my mind. Throw in some tacos. <laughs> and Cheetos. I am loved. And I love you guys too. You guys make my Saturdays. <laughs> okay. This. Hi, KP. This is an awesome clock. Look at this clock. Let me put it the right way. This is in perfect working condition. Um, I love this. For anybody who lives in Florida or California, any, any beachy place, the Carolinas, this is an amazing clock. OMG, how cool is this? I absolutely love it. It measures, whoops, hello, let's put it the correct way, like 11 inches in diameter. I love this. This clock is $20, number five. $20, number five. 
Beach houses, yes. People with beach houses. I'm poor folk. I don't have a beach house. <laughs> my beach house is Veranda Beach, my front, my front porch. Oh, Robert. Hi, Robert. All right, you got it. Thank you. Robert wants that. All right. Robert. All right, thanks so much. <laughs> yeah, yes, you have beaches of corn. <laughs> Okay, next up I have this awesome hand-painted cutting board. Look how cute this is. O-M-G. No, I didn't. This is the way I bought it. I never touched it. Nope. Oh, is it, Judy? Yeah, awesome. Anybody that's got nautical decor, look at the little mouse in there. How cute is that? Absolutely adorable. It's got felt on the back, so it won't scratch your wall when you hang it up. I know, right? Exactly. Exactly. Um, this is $14, number seven. $14, number seven. <laughs> He's so cute. He is too stinking cute. And I see Eugenia for that. Thank you, Eugenia. <clears throat> All right. Okay, guys. Let me bring some stuff over here. All right. Um, well, I'm going to do a Christmas item. This is awesome. Cute for your kitchen. Yes. Yes. <clears throat> this is a wonderful gift set. So you got your little snowman warmer and all your little wax melts in different fragrances. You have pine, you have pumpkin, and you have cinnamon stick. This would make a wonderful Christmas gift for someone. Um, anytime I find things like this, I pick them up. Because you never know when you're going to need an extra Christmas gift for someone. And it plugs into your outlet. You plug it into the outlet and you put your little wax melts in the top of his hat. And it does light up. There's the picture. So... This wonderful set is $16, number 49. $16, number 49. Brand new, never used. Hi, Ramola. <laughs> I got you for that one. Thank you. Ramola. All right. Ramol is going to take that one, number 49. Hi, Jan. How you doing, hon? <clears throat> okay. Um, I have a beautiful piece of Fenton for you. You're very welcome, Ramola. Thank you. This gorgeous Fenton hobnail ruffled bowl. It is in perfect condition. No issues whatsoever. 
it is six and three quarter inches in diameter and three and three quarter inches tall. There's Binks hair in it. This is $16, number 10. $16, number 10. You're very welcome, um, Robert. Um, it doesn't say Fenton on it, which means that it's before 1972 or 71. I can't remember. And I see Barb for that. Barb, was that the other item you wanted? <laughs> Uh, let me see. All right, Barb Connolly for that one. Oh my God, good. <laughs> Very good. All right. Okay, now, when I bought this, it was perfectly intact. And when I went to take it out of the bag, the lid fell out and broke, which I was pretty pissed off about. But this is a Ray Dunn Halloween. <laughs> it was a lidded jar, but unfortunately... As I said, the lid got broken. But I guess this would be for dog treats or whatever. But you could use it for anything. I mean, considering, you know, there's no lid for it now. You could put utensils in it or whatever. It's still really cute. Um, and it's at a good price. Uh, yeah, you could get a, yeah, you could. You could get a big cork. Absolutely. I didn't even think of that, Karen. Um, it's $12 and it's number 21. $12, number 21. It's so cute. He's a little devil. Look at him. And I see Miss Gypsy for that one. Thanks, Gypsy. All right. Okay, let me do these two, um, three. I have three purses left. We have this awesome Vera Bradley purse. It's beautiful, navy, white, and a bright orange pattern. There is the Vera Bradley. It's got a pocket over here. It's got... Um, a pocket here on the outside. On the inside, it's got a zipper pocket and three other pockets as well without zippers. Um, this is in like new condition. Like new condition, guys. And it is $22, number four. $22, number four. Oh, poodle. <laughs> Listen, girl, I'm, I don't even have any. I have very little uh, plastic left. Hard to come by. So $22, number, what did I say, four? Number four for the Vera Bradley. Now I have... This awesome Longa Burger flag patterned tote bag. And it's like a, it's kind of like a canvassy material. Plastastic, you know, the plastic Christmas wreaths and, and stuff like that, Angela. I call it plastastic. There's your Longa Burger um, patch on the front. This is gorgeous. It is canvas on the inside. This is brand new, guys. This was never, ever used. Hi, T 
Thomas, how are you? Brand new, never used. Oh my God, I absolutely love this bag. This is large. Um, this is $20, number 32. $20, number 32. Beautiful. Clemens, you got it. That's a beautiful bag right there. I have only found, that's my second Longa Burger bag. Second or third that I found. Thank you for coming, Maria, sweetheart. You have a wonderful weekend. Love you, girl. All right, and my last bag is this amazing fossil. This is that uh, coated canvas bag. This is awesome. This is in like new condition as well. OMG. Look at this bag. Now, it has... Um, something in the bottom that I'm going to try to get out. I forgot about it or I would have done it before the sale. Um, I'm not sure what it is. See that white in the bottom? So I'm going to try to get that out with some um, Dawn Power Wash. Should take it right out. Um, that's the only issue that this purse has, or bag, I should say. It is absolutely gorgeous. It is in amazing condition. Amazing. I'm not sure, Angela. I'm really not sure. It's kind of like, um, it's kind of like, um, sticky. I don't know. But anyways, um, I'll get it out. Um, this gorgeous fossil bag is uh, $20, and it's number 31. $20, number 31. No, I don't think it's lotion. It almost feels like... Um, Not gum, but it's, I don't know. It's hard to explain, but I will get it out. I will get it out. Sandra Garcia would like that wonderful bag. All right, Miss Sandra, you got it. If I, um, Sandra, let me just ask you while you're on here. If I can't get it out, do you still want the bag? That's the question. I should be able to get it out, but in the off chance I can't get it out, do you still want the bag? Let me know. Uh... Okay, Sandra, I'm going to try my hardest to get it out, though. Usually, I can get the get it out, so we'll see what happens. Okay, my next item is this beautiful vintage mirrored dresser tray. Look at that gorgeous etched design on there and my beautiful fan on the ceiling. OMG, and this is in fabulous condition. This is an offer up, um, Angela. This is an offer up, and it's starting at $16. I know, I was hoping it was blue, but unfortunately, it's not. 
It's got a felted back, which is in fabulous condition. And let me tell you the measurements on this. Seventeen inches long and ten inches wide. So seventeen by ten. And I absolutely love this. Look at how pretty that look at that etching. I absolutely love this piece. Seventeen by ten, felted back, won't scratch your furniture. Oh my goodness. See my kitchen? Look at. Yes. <laughs> it is beautiful. I was going to keep it, but I'm like, no, stop it, D. You can't keep everything. It does have some, a little bit of wear on it. It's kind of hard to show you, but there is. See, see some of the scratches on there from people, you know, from sliding the, you know, your stuff across it, but it is nothing major that takes away from the beauty of it. Isn't it beautiful, Jan? I was like, oh my God, look at that. I gotta have it. Now, of course, Scott. He would have found it in blue glass because Scott has a horseshoe up his butt, okay? He's got a horseshoe up his butt. But anyways, I'm just saying. All right. I, oh, <laughs> KP, I'm going to start to count it down, guys. 10, 9, 8, 7. He is 6. Five, four, three, two, one, and sold. I'm going to tell you right now, because when we go to visit him, we don't find stuff like he finds. I swear he's got honey holes that he does not take us to. <laughs> yes, Tammy, you know. Marty, okay, Marty got that. Thanks, Marty. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right. Marty Kelso, number 19 for $40. All right. All right. Wonderful. Okay. Back to Halloween. Now, this guy... He takes batteries. However, I, I put two button cell batteries in him and it didn't work. I don't know what kind of batteries it takes. So what I did is I just, I just fed some fairy lights up inside and it works perfect. Look at this. Look at this guy. He is lit up. Everything's lit up. He's awesome. His head is lit up as well. I know it's hard to see because of the lighting. So I will send the, the fairy lights with this guy. I have his original box. He came from Kirkland's. And... um. I will show you, um, I will open the uh, battery compartment and show you where the battery goes. I don't know if it takes one of those short stubby batteries or what, but anyways. Uh, he is 11 and a half inches tall. And he is $14, number 28. He's resin. He's also made of resin. $14, number 28. Hi, Stella. How are you? So this is the ba where the batteries go. See that? So I'm not sure 
if it takes, like, I don't know what, what the deal is. And I don't have the directions for it. And it doesn't say on the box either, like what size batteries. So you might be able to look it up online and see, you know. I bet you are, Stella. All right, so that is going to go to Joan Griswell. All right, thank you, Joan. Okay. Um, I have one of my craft projects that I did, but before I show you that, I just want to slide these items over here so I can get at them. Let me move this out of my way. All right. What is, okay. So y'all uh, saw in my haul videos that I was picking up um, bunt pans and said I was going to make a pumpkin centerpiece out of the bunt pans. Well, I made one today, and it came out so freaking cute. I love it. So, this one is going to be an offer up. And let me, let me just write in here, bunt pan pumpkin. Um, it is going to start at $18. Look how cute this came out. OMG. Not to mention, it's a three volt battery, Marianne. Okay. A three volt battery. Um, this is the, I, I bought this spray paint online. It's the perfect pumpkin color. Um, it only took me about a half hour to put it together. Um, oh, thanks, Pamela. I didn't paint the inside. I just left it alone. Um, the spray paint is like $14 a freaking can. I'm like, dang. But it's Rust-Oleum. Um, and oh my God, I absolutely love it. Thanks, Sally. <laughs> Thank you, Grandma. It's ridiculous. Thanks, Marty. So you would just set it like this right in the center of your table. <laughs> Thank you so much. So starting at $18, if anybody's interested. If not, we will move on and I'll keep it and put it on my table. <laughs> I love this. This is just a um, a stick from outside that I got and stuck in there. Um, there's um, some uh, Spanish moss and faux flowers and leaves and this awesome vintage looking scarecrow. And I just love it. I love the way it came out. Oh, uh, thank you, Jan. I see Jeffrey at $22. Desi is at $23. Desi wants it. I see. I see. Jeffrey's at $25. I'm making another one. I have another bunt pan. Um, I just haven't had time to put it together. But I'll bring that one to my sale next Saturday. There you go, Joan. All right. 
I am going to start to count this down. Desi is at 26. Um, I just, I love this, uh, this color spray paint. It's awesome. Because I didn't want anything really bright orange. You know what I mean? I wanted it more muted. All right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. Oh, Desi! Yay, Desi got it! Congratulations, Desi! Thank you so much! $26. Yay! Desi's Boho! Boho Flamingo! <laughs> All right! Congratulations! I got a hair in my eye. Okay, let me light this, and then I'll do that after my next item. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone. I really appreciate it. Okay, this next item is this vintage. I'm going to say this is like a nut dish of some sort. Um, as you can see, it is a um, ivory color with all of this beautiful gold detailing. Look at that handle. It looks like a branch from a tree. But then again, that looks like some guy bending over doing something. <laughs> Doesn't it? <laughs> he's like got real long legs and he's bending over and he's doing something. A plumber. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> um, it does have uh, felt things on the bottom so that it doesn't uh, scratch the furniture. Um, it does have, let me see, are there any chips? I don't see any chips. It does have crazing. It's really in fantastic condition. Is it? <laughs> no, I meant like it looked like he was bent over working. I didn't mean doing something nasty. <laughs> so. <laughs> What's up, Lori? <laughs> yeah, this is gorgeous. So this dish is. $16, number 16. $16, number 16. <laughs> Sandra Garcia. All right, Miss Sandra, you got that. Thank you. It's beautiful, and it's in fantastic condition. Your um your beautiful needlepoint got shipped out today, uh, UPS Sandra, and your other box is USPS. Thank you so much. Okay, this next item is also awesome, but it does have a chip, and I will show it to you. Look at this awesome, like a fairy lamp. It has the frosted, um, the frosted shade, and it's like, oh yeah, um, it's got like a, a vintage, like a, I don't know how to describe it, um, a patinaed metal base. Okay, this is what it looks like underneath. And this is the chip right here on the rim. Let me turn it that way. Let 
okay? Um, that is the only chip other than a couple of little tiny uh, little flea bites right here along the top. Um, I can actually sand that, you know? Um, but yeah, so... Let me see, how tall is this? Uh, it is about 13 and a half inches tall. And I, I love it. Um, it is, oh, this was supposed to be an offer up. I just blew out the candle when I said up. <laughs> um, it is going to start at... $14. Whoopsie. $14. And I love it. I think it is so awesome. It's got that real rustic, um, that real rustic uh, vibe. Hey, Maricel, how's it going, girl? Very, very cool piece. Love it. And I do see a uh, Judy at $14. If there's no other interest, I'm going to start to count it down. It's going finally. All right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. I see the sold. I'm just waiting to see who got it. Okay, Maricel, you got it for $15. Congratulations. All right. Okay. Um, my next item is this awesome, um, this is a flat priced item. This awesome uh, violet cheese cover. Oh, hi, Laura. So this is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Uh, it isn't marked. I don't know who makes it, but it is, it's in beautiful condition. It does have crazing, which you can see. Um, but I don't see any chips or anything on it. Um, I don't know what that is. That's like a piece of porcelain. Yeah, it's in fantastic condition, guys. This is going to be $18, number 30. $18, number 30. It is a cheese cover, or you could use it uh, to cover butter. Um, you know, you put your cheese or whatever on a plate, and then this would go over the top. Um, and it has a little, like a little vent hole right there. Judy Reardon for this one. Thanks, Judy. It's gorgeous. It really is a beautiful piece. All right.
<laughs> okay. Um, next up, I have, I had this at a sale before, but I'm bringing it back again. Um, I have this awesome vintage Kleenex box cover, that kind of Hollywood Regency kind of style, right? It's in great condition. It's got a little bit of paint or something on here, and I could not get that off. So it looks like somebody was painting and left it in there and got a drop of paint on there. Um, but other than that, it's in fabulous condition. This is $14 and it's number 15. $14, number 15 for the vintage Kleenex box cover. Sandra, okay, I got you for that. All right. All right. Um, I've got two items left, guys. And that's it. Okay, this. Oh, my gosh. This is such a gorgeous picture in and of itself. Um, it's from 1943. And it is a litho. And I bought the picture um, in an old shitty frame at a yard sale. And I got rid of the frame and put it in this awesome vintage frame. Look at this, y'all. Um, this is going to be an offer up. And it's going to start at $14. Look at this picture. There is the information. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Oh my word. Look at that. I was going to keep it if the baby was a girl. But it's a little boy, and my Winnie is a girl. So, absolutely, it's an 8 by 10. Here is the back of the frame. You can stand it or hang it if you want to. Isn't that stunning? That picture is everything. Absolutely everything. Oh, Eugenia, yes. It is a pink blanket on the baby, but then the baby's in blue, so I don't know. Maybe it is a girl. I don't know. But it's just absolutely gorgeous. I guess maybe it is a girl. I didn't even think about that. You guys are correct. Maybe it is a girl. It's got pink blanket and pink flowers. Oh, whatever. It's still stunning. <laughs> All right. I am going to start to count this down. It's just beautiful. And this frame could not be more perfect. It could not be more perfect. Okay. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and sold. It is, it is absolutely stunning. Stunning. I held on to that for a long while. Was it really, Ramola? Oh, my gosh. Poodle. Oh, my word. You got it. Oh, wow. Okay. Number 45 for $30 to Poodle. It 
It is absolutely stunning, is it not? Oh my gosh. Okay, um, my last item is another crafted item that I did. Um, hopefully not for a couple years, because I there's no way I could watch her now and have another little one running around. I'm not young anymore, peeps. I'm not young anymore, peeps. I'm just, I can't do it. Um, this is going to be an offer up. And this is going to start at $20. And I made this the other day. So I purchased this sweater last year for this project. And I just made it this year. So we have this awesome, it is a pumpkin. It's those pumpkin um, forms that you can buy at Dollar Tree. I bought the sweater at Goodwill or Salvation Army. And then I dressed it up with all of these beautiful uh, florals in the fall colors. And it has a hanger. It has a wire hanger right here on the back. That's what it looks like from behind. And this would look awesome on a wall, on a door. Um, I, I made one of these. I sold one of these last year. Um, I saw the, um, the tutorial for this on YouTube last year. Yes. Oh, thank you. <laughs> what did you do, Angela? Did you make something with that with that wreath form? Oh, thanks, Kim. I watch a lot of YouTube stuff. Yes, perfect on a door. And these are beautiful. Um, these are Hobby Lobby flowers, guys. These are all Hobby Lobby flowers that I got at the thrift store. So, heck yeah. And this this uh, sweater is like the perfect color. Thank you so much, KH. I appreciate it. Thank you, Karina. Oh, yay, Jennifer, you got your purse. Woohoo! Oh, they switched the baby colors mid-century, okay. So that, that's a girl then. Oh, okay, gotcha, Angela. All right, I am going to count this down, everyone. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. Uh. <laughs> okay, I see the sold. Barb Connolly for 31. Congratulations, Barb. And thank you to everyone that bid on that. I really appreciate it. So, guys, I only have a couple items that didn't sell today. So, I'll run through them real quick. Um, I had this awesome Winnie the Pooh tote bag. That's in fabulous, like new condition. And this uh, poo bag, it's like a, it's like a coated vinyl, I guess. Um, it's $22 and it's number 44. $22, number 44. Uh, 
Um, I had this uh, beautiful Vera Bradley purse that is in like new condition. Oh, Donna RN wants number 44. Okay, thanks, Donna RN. You're new to me. Um, please be sure to send me your info. Oh, you like poo? I do too. I do too. Um, Virginia just put the link in the chat for you to fill out my um, live sale registration form. Thank you so much. Okay. Um, this beautiful Vera Bradley purse is uh, $22, number four. $22, number four. And um, then I had this beautiful, this is a Lefton um, saucer um, missing its cup, but it's so pretty. I thought it would still look beautiful as a display plate. And this is um, $8, number 41. $8, number 41 for that. And I think the saucer, the Vera Bradley. Oh, and then I had, oh, thank you, Donna. And then I had this awesome clown um, cork for $10, and it was number 25. $10, number 25. And that's everything, you guys. Thank you all so much for being here today. I really appreciate it so much, and please be sure to pop on over to Vintage Vinny's channel at 6 o'clock, and then at 8 o'clock, Pamela Blanchard has a sale. I see you for 25 Jeffrey. Thank you. Um, Pamela Blanchard's sale is at 8 o'clock. Thank you, Poppy. Yay, KP. Thank you to all of my moderators for helping me today. I really appreciate you guys so much. Um, I don't know if Nate and Katie have a sale tonight at 10, but it's usually on Katie's channel. So be sure and check that out as well. Judy, it was so good to see you, sweetheart. Good to see you. All right, everybody, um, I will start invoicing tomorrow, and I will see you in my next video, guys. Bye. Thank you.